Hi, welcome to Alex's Tech Guides. In this video, I'm going to show you the fastest and easiest way to delete an old Windows installation off a second hard drive. So as you can see, I have a C and an E drive, and my E drive has Windows installed on it because I used it as a Windows C drive for a while. So I want to get rid of this Windows folder because it's taking up a lot of space, but if you try and delete it, it says you're not authorized. So the first thing you want to do is click on Windows, folder, right click, and hit rename. Then at the end of Windows just put period old, windows.old. Once that's done, come down here, type in disk clean up and hit enter. It'll open this window. You select the letter of the drive you want to delete Windows from. Mine is E. Press OK. It'll bring up this window here. You're going to want to hit Clean Up System Files. Then it'll bring up this same prompt again. Select your drive again. Press OK. It'll go through this process of calculating the amount of storage taken up by your old Windows installation. It will only take a minute or so, and then you'll be able to delete your old Windows installation. Okay, the dialog just finished. Now, as you can see, we have three options instead of two before deselect the recycle bin, select previous Windows installations, press OK. Are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? I'm going to say delete files. And now it'll delete the old Windows installation without having to change any permissions. If you like this video, subscribe. If you have friends who have the same problem, feel free to recommend it to them.